Do not do a photo shoot if you want to enjoy your wedding day. And that maybe sounds very strange coming from a professional wedding photographer. But I got some good reasons for it. So hear me out for five minutes before you start killing me in the comments because I think I've got some great reasons for it. So recently my wife and I got married. And when we were planning the wedding, together with the wedding planner, we were thinking about how we gonna build up this day and what we want to do in a day and what we think is important and on a day and the thing we find very important is that people really really enjoy themselves and they are entertained and they don't have to wait for us to do something like a photo shoot so we decided to not do a photo shoot we didn't even do group photos oh no he didn't <laughs> it's kind of strange coming from a guy that's made a full career out of it doing photo shoots Photographing people in the most beautiful settings, most beautiful ways, but not doing my doing it myself. So you could say you don't practice what you preach. Well, I actually do practice what I preach because on my own wedding I didn't do a photo shoot. And I'm not saying you should do a photo shoot, but hear me out to test if you should do a photo shoot on your wedding. On our wedding day, uh, after the first look. And the first look was, was with all our guests, so 100 guests. We did a first look together with them. I told them, um, I, I gave a little speech after that, and I told them I want to live in the moment. So I told them to take a good look around them to see who's there, friends, family. We got a lot of friends from outside the Netherlands. We got American family. And I asked them to take a good look around to see who's there and fully take in a moment to appreciate who's there because your life will change people will go away will you lose friends and you really have to enjoy the moment of being together because our wedding isn't about us it's about celebrating love and life together with our best friends and family and if you talk about celebrating together we should do it fully together and i ask the people not to look back in the past or to look in the future, but just to make a mark in your timeline and enjoy your day, this day, because this is the only day you're alive. It's not about yesterday, it's about tomorrow. Fully enjoy your day. After the wedding, we got a lot of compliments from people saying they never ever enjoyed the wedding as much as our wedding. And some of our guests are even professional wedding planners because they're colleagues of mine. And they said because everything was so different, everything was so in the moment, it was different from all the weddings. And even after the wedding, we received a very few photos from friends and family because a lot of people just forgot to use their smartphones. In 2024, people forgot to use their phones. And that says a lot about what we wanted to achieve with our wedding. So how do you know if you want to do a photo shoot? Because you look probably look amazing on your wedding. So your photographer will, or photographers will, absolutely make beautiful photos of you in the moment like snapshots i think snapshots are still the best way to, to, to photograph people in their natural movement natural way of being but the irony of my work is that a lot of people ask me to do a photo shoot but I'm also afraid of the camera so i know how to make people relax to do a great photo shoot but still it's kind of strange because you think this thing where i'm talking to is kind of scary but you want those photos so I've made a little list, of a little checklist to check if you really want to do a photo shoot. So ask yourself what five photos would you want to see after your wedding? So if my wife and I would think about, about our wedding, well, what do we want to see? We want to see our friends having fun. We want to see our little son, our newborn son um, um, on the wedding. Uh, we want to see each other a kiss so my wife and I in a snapshot kind of way because I'm very aware of the camera uh, I want to see the setting the wedding setting because it's in our own was in our own garden and it's really really cool to have a festival wedding in your own garden so I want to see that and I want to see us kiss for the first time and all these things have nothing to do with a photo shoot I would love to have some photos of my wife and I on our, on our beautiful moment in our suit and dress or we can make them another time we can do like a destination pre or post wedding shoot uh, after the wedding to do great stuff with it but on our wedding day was was the best thing to not do it so on our wedding day because we didn't do a photo shoot and group photos on our wedding we won at least three four hours with 
not doing those things and we could enjoy our wedding even more. So if you're planning your wedding for 2024, 2025, 2026 and upwards, really think of what you want to do with your wedding. Do you want to be in the moment and don't want to be uh, pulled away for a photo shoot, pulled away for our group photos or do you really want to be um, the center of attention? Do you want to have the photo shoot? And it's all right to be center of attention. Some people want that. Some people dreamt the whole life of being at the center of a photo, beautiful, majestic photo. But some people just want to enjoy themselves and want everyone to enjoy themselves at the wedding. And if you want to do both, just ask your photographer to do a post wedding photography shoot. So a week, couple of weeks after that. So hire a makeup artist, put on your, your wedding clothes and find a beautiful location. Choose the exact great time of the photo shoot because that's the best thing. You can make the perfect photos in the morning or in the evening. You can, uh, you're not, uh, um, uh, there's no tension anymore because you're married. So there's no tension of what, what is the wedding going to do. So it, there's always a solution to a problem. So now I'm very, very curious how you think about my opinion about photo shoots. And let me know in the comments if you're a bride or groom and getting married and you really didn't think of it or you're a photographer you said, and you say, we need to do a photo shoot. I'm just curious what you guys think and keep it civilized because that's the way we do it in the comment section.